Could you make it rain? No. Well, that's, that's the subject of tonight's weird weather. In the early 1900s, there was a gentleman who said he could make it rain, Charles M. Hatfield. Well, he said for $50, he could deliver. Well, Los Angeles farmers said, we need rain. Will you make it rain? He did. And they were so happy, they paid him $100. Well, there was a lake in the area, Lake Hemet. He said for $4,000, he could deliver four inches of rain. So he made this tower and he mixed up some chemicals. Guess what? 11 inches of rain fell and it rose 22 feet. Operators say it was the best bargain they'd ever had. There was another area that needed it. San Diego City contracted him to fill Lake Marina in one year. If he did it, $10,000. If not, he didn't get a penny. January 1st, he put his towers up and started sending his chemicals away. January 5th, it began to rain. What is that? It's disappeared. Is this a skinwalker on his roof? Freaky, the shadow from the tree making all these rings because of the eclipse, which you can't tell. But look how trippy that is! But look how trippy that is! Is this part of the eclipse? I don't know. It could be. Looks strange. I've never seen it before. <laughs>
Qué raro. Todas las sombras son medias lunas del árbol. Como ya está el reflejo del eclipse, me están tirando. ¡Wow! ¡Qué padrísimo! Voy a hacer otro video. Tell me why when there is a solar eclipse, look at this. The shadows are circles. How cool is this, guys? How amazing. So cool. This is some weird scurry shit. Oh, hell no, you guys. Have to see this. What the heck is that? just moved into this house and I found this little room right here and every time at night I keep hearing noises from the closet <gasps> if you came here to kill me clap your hands well that wasn't clapping your hands that was more like just okay, I'm so to my hotel room and immediately see this you see that line under the door what is this Maybe it's a kind of service. What? Is this a smuggling tunnel? What is this? What the fish snatch? Let's see what's going on here. This is crazy. This is a hotel. Let's stick it all the way in. What the fish? Warning. The following is very frightening. Everything got killed. There's no light, just the candles. Oh, oh. oh please. Don't let it be nothing satanic up in this motherfucker. Oh, oh boy, I knew I shouldn't play with this goddamn Ouija shit. Oh, oh. oh God, my worst fear. Oh, oh. oh. Oh, oh God, I hear footsteps.
Okay. Come on, ghost. If there's a ghost in this house. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Okay. Okay. Selsa asks who Lauren Combs lives in an isolated area and enjoys spending time with her two pets. She would upload videos about her two pets to the internet until one day strange events started happening. First, while talking to her sister in the kitchen a bottle suddenly fell on the table. Next while exploring her backyard she noticed a half-dead tree with holes. After closing up on the tree, she finds the skull of a dead animal. If that wasn't creepy and disturbing enough, wait until you see this. If this creeped you out, hit the plus sign. And we know we're the only people in the house. There's no one else here. I'm gonna stay here. Huh? I'm gonna stay here. Stay here. Alright. Didn't come from this area of the house, but it sounded like footsteps. <gasps> Jesus Christ, the door just closed. Was there someone in? Did you see anyone? No. Guys, is there anyone in here? I don't think so. No one behind the door. Hello? Hello? Mariño? Hello? Okay, so... I'm literally home alone. Listen to how loud and aggressive it is. That's why we're moving! Ball with you? Yeah. You need someone to play ball? Bye -bye. I really don't think I'm ever gonna be able to stop this shit. Listen to it. This is my whole closet right here. This is my kitchen.
This video was uploaded by YouTuber D's Dark Adventures. A man in a neighborhood watches called to check out a strange man at the end of their cul-de-sac. This is what he came across. Creepy right, what do you think he was doing there? <laughs> 